Hey guys, and welcome to my Wayward Infinite Water Tutorial. So this tutorial is going to show you how to get pretty much as much water as you can drink without breaking a sweat. So the thing we're actually building is called the Solar Still. So the advantage of the Solar Still is you put the water in it and it automatically um, turns the water into desalinated water. The reason this is so good is you don't have to light fires. So lighting fire uses wood, takes time, and it's all just overall cumbersome. More like having the solar still makes it so you never have to do any work. The hardest part about making the solar still is why sometimes you can't make it super early on is because you need limestone. So limestone is not always hard to find, but it's not always, I find the best idea to look for it right off the get go when you're trying to build a house and establish yourself. So, you're going to need a mortar and pestle. I recommend making quite a few um, until you get a good one because then you can just carry it around with you. So, it's just two smooth rocks. So, we'll grind up this into limestone. You're only going to need one powder, but you may as well turn it all into limestone because the rocks don't do anything and its powders are very light. The other thing you are going to need is a furnace. So, they're just eight rocks, so you can just mine out your eight rocks really easily from any wall. So, oh, spider wants to fight me. Oh, I'm surprised it didn't one hit. Usually one hit the spiders, but maybe I'm having an off day or something. So, okay, so the other thing we're going to need is sand. I didn't put it on here, but I believe you need three refined sand. But you can just get a whole bunch of sand. Um, you're going to need the shovel tool for this since you're going to be digging. So, so just dig until you get sand. You won't always get one per area like that. Um, this is an important thing is this is actually clay that's underneath here. So that's more than enough sand. Actually, oh no, sorry, it's two refined sand. Oh no, it's one, one to one, okay. It's, I was actually thinking of green sand. Green sand's two to one, but. So refined sand is a sand in a mortar and pestle. So like I said, you're gonna need three sand because we're going to be making the sheet of glass. The last thing we're going to need is tongs. I recommend the wood tongs because they're good enough for what you're going to need. So they're just a pull, a string, and a sharpened stick. So perfect, we got an exceptional wood pole. So these tongs will stick with me for the entire game if I get a good enough string, which is a very good way to do it. Nope. Do I not have any more exceptional string? Well, that's not good with the world. So you can even just put your best string forward. So that's my best string. Make your tongs. And we got 44, 49. Quite good. So all we'd have to do is light our furnace. So get your fire making tools. That's why I just like putting them on the ground because sometimes it's a pain when you can't remember which one you put your fire making tools in. So we got one shot here. Otherwise, I'll pick up some sticks. Okay, let's see if we can get on our first one. Perfect. So, all you gotta do then is combine your refined sand and your limestone power, and you will get your sheet of glass. So, sheet of glass complete. Um, you need a container. So, I recommend taking your lowest um, durability container. Um, so, we're actually gonna keep the bottle. Bottles are a little bit lighter than water skins. So, they're a little bit better, so we'll use the water skin. So, bye. Ooh, well. Okay, we got lucky. If it would have broke, we would have been kind of in trouble because you need something to fill it up. So anyway, now we have our solar still. Let's build it here. So it looks like this. When you look at it, if you see, if it says you see a solar still, that means there's no water in it. So we can just go down, grab some water, and all you have to do is wait. So fill up your bottle, empty it into your still. And once it's empty, it will say there's unpurified water in the still. That is your hint that you have water in the still, but it is not completed yet. 
repairing bottles as well is important is a good way to keep them around so anyway guys we'll be back in a second once this water has purified once you can evaluate the solar still and it says you see a solar still you can gather water from it and you'll have a bottle of desalinated water without any work or anything whatsoever. I also recommend whenever you pull a bottle out, you put a bottle back in, which requires you to have two containers because you could, you have to use one to put in, the other one to pull out. But this way you always have a source of water and thus infinite water. Thanks guys.